from downtown Detroit, Local 4 News at 5.30 starts now. A mother's heartache. This Detroit woman forced to plan two funerals after losing her sons to gun violence. It's almost unthinkable for any parent, but tonight, Lita Watts is doing it. Her two sons, 24-year-old Alex and 28-year-old Lewis, were gunned down Sunday night on Detroit's west side. Coco McAvoy spoke to her today. I lost two children in one day, and it's, it, it just hurts. It hurts. Lita Watts raced to the scene on Schaefer when she heard her sons, Alex and Lewis, had been shot. When I got the call, I was praying that it wasn't as bad as they said it was. But she soon realized both of her sons were gone and still has no idea why. From what I understand, it had nothing to do with them. She says her sons were talented and wanted to do something good with their lives. Louis always wanted to act and and he did for a while. And Alex, he did, had a dream to draw. But Watts can't get the graphic scene from last night out of her mind. When I got here, my son was laying on the ground. He laid out there for seven hours. She feels guilty. She wasn't there with Alex in the hospital when he died. I just couldn't be in two places at one time. Now she is a strong message for the person who carelessly stole her son's lives and left her with a heavy heart. I hope you ride in hell. And I hope every day that you live your life, it'd be miserable. And I don't think I would ever forgive him. Of course, our prayers and thoughts for that family. A GoFundMe uh, page has been set up to also help with funeral expenses for that family.